If we look at the framework of productivity uh, that Hay Group uses and that these articles in Focus have really picked up on in more detail, there are two key levers we look at when we think about productivity. We think about engagement and we think about enablement. Now when we talk about enablement, we think about the sorts of things that many organisations already think about when they think about productivity. They think about efficiency, they think about structures, processes and, and so forth. But we feel as important as enablement are aspects of engagement. And here we're talking about confidence and leadership, line of sight clarity uh, and alignment with customers and um, customers' needs. And by working with both of these areas and these key drivers of productivity, we see organisations more able to tap into the discretionary effort of their staff. And if you like, that's the ability to, of staff to go over and beyond the call of duty. If we take a look just at one example there, um, one of the key drivers of engagement and discretionary effort is the extent to which staff have confidence in their leaders. And so the ability of a leader to engage staff in the direction of the organisation, give them real clarity on the role that's expected of them and create clear line of sight between these two has a huge impact on what it feels like for people to come to work, has a huge impact on how an individual feels about their leader that they work for and that in turn drives discretionary effort which drives greater productivity. So if you like, this framework can work as a bit of a self-test for a lot of leaders. They can have a look at these various drivers of productivity. They can read focus and understand a bit more about what goes into each of these levers and examples from other organisations that have done well in these areas and figure out the areas where they're already strong and also think about areas where they may be able to put in some extra effort to get that discretionary effort and to get that lift in productivity that so many local leaders are looking for in this economic climate. And that in turn, as we see the productivity of organisations grow, leads to the growth of the individual organisation and can also have a very strong benefit on the broader economic situation as well.